So if we look at the surface here quite closely, you can see it's, it's quite smooth. There's still a, a little bit of a sheen there. That, that's indicating that there's still some sealer on the surface, which when compared with a driveway on the right here, um, is very dry, basically very dry, very dull. That's telling us, as you'd expect after 20 plus years, there's no sealer uh, present at all. The lack of sealer leaves the surface really vulnerable, not only to the buildup of algae and lichens, but also to colour loss, which you can see has occurred here. So when you're looking at your own driveway and, and maybe trying to work out you know, what needs to be done, uh, normally the, the area where the vehicle sits, as you can see here, is in the best condition. And again, the fact that nothing's been done for over 20 years, that's pretty good. The area to my left here, which has regularly seen the uh, vehicles coming in and out uh, and left unprotected by the sealer, you can see not only has it become very vulnerable, but also the surface aggregate has started to come through. Again, the material that was screeded into the concrete to achieve the colour uh, has started to wear away. You can see a good comparison here for the area where the colour hardener, the colour is relatively true, where it's remained protected by the vehicle sitting here to the area where it's gradually got worn away.